Hey guys, welcome back to Bougie Palettes. My name is Honey and today we are having another seafood boil, guys. I have been craving it, so here we are again. I did the boil in a bag method. So I have some green lip mussels, some colossal shrimp, um, a piece of leftover sausage from yesterday's video. <laughs> we don't waste food around these parts. And corn, potatoes, and I even threw in some asparagus because I'm into that today. All right, let's just get into it. I bought a little bowl just in case I want to dump it. Let's see how this turns out first. Hopefully it's still hot. Can y'all see that steam? All right, should I dump it in the bowl or straight onto this thing? All right, I got up and got a pie dish because I figured that would be flat but still a little shallow. Ooh, child, this is hot. a Dasani sparkler to drink. It tastes really good. It tastes just like, um, tastes like water, like a lemonade water. It's naturally sweetened, so it doesn't have that aftertaste. I might still get up and get a red rock. I'm going to start with the green lip mussels. that guys and they're already cleaned out mm, mm, mm. oh my god that bite was so bomb I got these from my farmers market one of my Asian markets rather and they come on the half shell frozen I think I put like 20 in here but it's like still three quarters of the box left this is so good. Oh my gosh. Mm, mm, mm. I need more. And I'm glad they already cleaned out so I don't have to pull a J. Let's eat. Oh my God. Have you guys seen her eat muscles? I was watching her like an hour ago. She chucks them. I think I told y'all that. She literally ch chucks them if they have a beard or they look weird or if they're too big. So right now, I'm sure she's watching this cringing. Mm. I don't eat muscle, um, onions, but I'm going to eat that. Can y'all see this? They taste so good. Did I tell y'all I have some colossal shrimp in there? Look at this bad boy. Mm -mm. He's too hot. We're going to suck on him later. Steph did the solo video today and she was eating asparagus with hers. And I had some in the refrigerator. So we already knew. Mmm. Oh my gosh. Guys, the next time you do a seafood boil with B-Love sauce, include the asparagus. And I intentionally overcook mine. Don't come for me. Mm -mm -mm. I seasoned it perfectly and with her sauce. Y'all gonna see a lot of this. I love asparagus. I know a lot of people don't like the smell. It's quite offensive, I know. But it's so good. I'm so happy right now. 
Did you guys have a good day? Hmm? I actually did. I don't get to say that often. As far as work goes, nobody bothered me. Like, nobody. I was able to work in peace. For the first time in years. I don't know what's up with that. And it's so pretty out. It's like 70 degrees. Ooh, that potato's hot. I tried to go for a walk. And of course it started raining. On the prettiest day. We don't have to time out. Eat a few more muscles till that cools off. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Man, I should have made more. Mm. Once again, this is definitely my best batch of B Love sauce. <laughs> Everyone I make, I say that. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. I wasn't even going to make this today until I saw Jay's video. I just started craving it. I think Sharika's video too. She Glam TV? Mm. Can't remember her new channel's name. Mm. I'm just hungry today, guys. Come back for this bad boy. Mmm. Mm-mm. Why they so big and good? Mm -mm. Mm. when I'm editing my videos all I see me doing is just shaking my head because it's so good so now I'm trying to make a conscious effort not to do that it's just so amazing. Hope y'all can see it. There we go. Mm. I'm still doing it. Everybody had a good Super Bowl weekend. I'm kind of glad it's over. I'm not a football girl, but I still enjoy the festivities, you know? Mm -mm -mm.
Wow. See if I can get a potato. Mm. You guys, I cannot front. As much as I love the butter sauces, I am so sick of seeing it drip down my face and everybody else's face. I think I'm tired of it. But we can't do anything about it. We can't control it. And I'm not going to not eat it. Because I tried using like my mayo-based sauce. It's just not the same on a hot boil. Mmm. Let's see if my leftover sauce is still good. Yep. If it ain't burnt, it ain't good. That breakfast was so good yesterday, guys. I was on my back. I couldn't even move afterwards. At least all my ginger. There we go. It's going to be a good bite. Mm -mm -mm. I think mean, I got too much on my mind to really focus on my conversation. Mm. You guys ever come to that road in your career when you really have to make moves? So you got like a million things going on in your head. You're trying to plan out perfectly. That's where I am. You don't want to make the wrong decision. You don't want to burn a bridge. But you know you have to have change come soon. I feel butter. Can't see it all. So my mind is racing, making sure I do the right thing for my family. Your corn people very important my sauce is runny because of all the chicken stock I added trying to be mindful of the butter it's a good bite guys can y'all see that Mm. I am hooked. See, I grew up on oysters and clams. I didn't grow up on mussels. My parents were holding back. This one is kind of smaller. I told y'all these came in a bag frozen with two pounds in it. 
instead of getting them by the pound individually. So I'm not going to do that again because they sneak little ones inside the bag. My baby was mostly eating these ones, the smaller ones. I'm gonna have to go back tomorrow and get me some more. Come on now, play nice. I want some more king crab. Y'all saw Casey Connections had that big old crab yesterday. She said she got it for 99 bucks from Costco. So you know I called Costco immediately. Said I didn't have it. That might be a Florida thing. I was so mad at life. Mmm. -hmm. Whew, this is an amazing feeling. That feeling where it's not too full, but just right. Like I can stop right now, but I'm so greedy. Why do I do this to myself? But one thing I do not get to lay down like after videos. Like I'm always up for hours later. Mm-mm-mm. And if the weather holds up some more. I'll try to walk again. That's all, folks. More of this mukbang. Never film a mukbang when you're preoccupied, when you have too much going on in your brain. Because then you can't focus on your people, and it's not fair to you guys. So, I got y'all next time. Thank you guys for joining me. I hope you did enjoy this kind of silent mukbang. And I will see you guys with Alicia in the next video.